Hey everybody, it is I. I want to talk about this new show on Discovery called The Blended Bunch. I'm going to say first and foremost, I'm 54 years old. My daughters are in their 30s and I raised them prior to the internet. And so I don't know what I would have done had any uh, uh, television station approach me and said, hey, we want to do a movie about your life or a show about your life or a series. And I, I don't know yet. I, this is what I do know about people in today's day and age that put their children on the internet and get paid to do so. And even people that don't get paid. And I watched the first episode, second episode is let's talk about sex where they sit down with their older children, I think 10 and 12 years old, and they discuss the birds and the bees with them. I want to know how much you're being paid for your children's privacy. Like I said, I wasn't perfect and I wasn't the perfect parent, but I know for a fact that there has to be a line drawn when we say there's certain part aspects of my children's lives that are not going to be made public. And this is one of them. The talk should be between a guardian or a parent and the child. And the child should not be exploited in any way, shape, or form regarding their reaction, their discomfort, um, embarrassment. But unfortunately, it seems that parents, some parents today, don't really care. Is it, does it come down to the almighty dollar? Did they say it doesn't matter because, you know, Discovery Plus or Hulu, et cetera, is willing to give us a certain amount of money in order to just be present in our lives at all times. I don't understand it. I know it's hard enough that the man and the woman both lost their spouses. I think the woman has seven children and he, the man has four and they lost each of them lost their spouses within the past couple of years. So first and foremost, I don't think these children have been really have been given the opportunity to grieve, but now they're thrust into a situation then their lives are put in a public forum for the whole world to see. So they have to go through their suffering and dealing with a new stepmom, stepdad, etc., new siblings, a new home. Dad, I don't remember where dad was living, but he up and moved with his four very young children to move closer to the wife, this woman. And they said, surprise, here we go. So I, I just want to say I, there has to be a certain boundary with children, a certain line you will not cross certain way to say there's no price tag on my children's privacy, emotions, etc. So I, I just, I, I, I started out really kind of was just listening. I always have background noise on, so I was kind of listening. But when they talked with their children about sex with the camera crew, I, I can't, I can't, sorry. I don't agree with that. It's just one of those shows that hopefully they'll last. Maybe they won't. I don't know. It just seems like anytime someone's together, <laughs> go on reality TV, they don't end up lasting because it's too much pressure. <laughs> so anyways, that's what I wanted to talk about, and I'll be back.